Okay, Gemini, this is going to be um, a December read. Um, you know, what to expect in December, you know. And then we do have uh, Christmas and the holidays. Okay, for Gemini, what can Gemini expect in December? Let's see. You can expect some things to um, become more balanced in your life. Okay, two of wands reversed. Um, not feeling like, you know, you don't know where... Okay, in the past it feels like you felt like you, you didn't know where things were going, where they were headed. Uh, I feel like that now things are going to be more balanced and you're not going to feel like you're at a crossroads trying to figure out what your next move is. Um, it's that type of feeling. Uh, I feel like that... Um, yeah... Things are changing. Um, you know, things expect for things to get better on the money side, money aspect, and expect uh, your cre more creative skills to start showing and shining through. Uh, there may be uh, something new in your horizon that could be a new uh, relationship. Um, I also feel like for some of you, new keys to something could be involved. That could be a house, that could be a home, uh, could be a um, vehicle. But for some of you, you know, this is a feeling like um, you have a lot of options and choose wisely. Build solid foundations. Don't um, look at illusions. Don't try to build from illusions. Yeah. Take off the rose-colored glasses. See things for what they truly are. Don't be held back. Um, because right now, you know, is a time for you to move forward with the chariot. It's a time for you to uh, move forward in your life. You know, let go of the past and allow change to um, pave the way, it feels like. Six of Pentacles is reversed. So, I feel like that um, something that you had wanted, you're, you're going to have a realization that it's not, it's just not, some things aren't meant. They aren't meant to um, be the way that we want them to be. So, I feel like you're going to have that realization and, and that's going to help set you on your path. Traveling towards where you need to be. Um, getting out of... The cage, so to speak, not being trapped. Um, a lot of change coming your way, you know, it feels like. You're being seen. Um, I feel like that someone from your past is watching you on possibly social media. Someone you closed a door to a long time ago. And it feels like they're watching you. Um, you know, I feel like that something at some point in time went wrong with that person. Um, this feels like this is a long time ago. And it's like they want to apologize um, and bring a balance to your relationship. Whoever this is, they've been watching you for some time, for quite a while. They just haven't had the strength to come forward... Um, this is someone that feels like, you know, you could be their wish come true. They haven't had the strength to come forward towards you. It could be a Leo. Um, doesn't have to be, though. And this person, you know, it's like they've been watching and waiting for something to change. Something to take place. And it's like that's happened. So now it's like they're ready to step out into the sunlight. Step out of the darkness and... Uh, show themselves to you. I feel like you're going to be surprised. You're never going to expect who this is. Um, someone from your past that may get in touch with you. Um, you know, like I said, we've got Christmas coming up, the holidays. Um, so, yeah. Expect the unexpected. <laughs> That's what this feels like. Um, okay, I want to take you some... I want to take you a card around uh, romance. You know, that could very well be romance. It could be something else. It could be a family member. It could be um, many things. Okay, release your ex. The time has come for you to clear your energy. So you need to release your ex so that you can move forward. 
show me romance card four okay yeah make the effort great love is worth taking the steps that you are guided to take but it feels like you do need to release whatever you're holding on to and it's got to do with an ex um, any more about this person or okay any more about romance for two of wands see up here we had the two of um the two of wands was reversed it's going to be upright where romance in your life is concerned because you're going to have a choice to make i feel like you got someone from the past coming back and then you need to release your ex you may be holding yourself looking back looking back see there yeah uh, don't be looking back now you know when i say someone from the past could be coming back you could have a um justice the scales need to be balanced. You could have someone new coming on your path. You could have someone old coming on your path. And you could be hanging on to a relationship that you need to let go of. The Empress. Um, I feel like that, you know, you need to pull yourself together for you if you haven't. You need to know your worth and your value. And know that you are worthy to have what you desire. The hair font is reversed again. So this tells me that there has been failure in the past where a relationship is concerned. And you definitely need to clear what has been needing to be cleared. Ace of Pentacles. Things are looking good for you though. Um, it's like there will be clarity. And you will be able to uh, move forward in a better light. Um, and you may, like I said, you got someone wanting, you know, to come back into your life, but then you're holding on to someone else or a relationship. And you may be like, no, we've been over for a long time. I haven't been holding on to it. Well, if you're allowing yourself to think about it, then they live rent free in your mind. Yeah. So, um, don't allow that. Okay. Now, financial. Page of Swords, you're going to get some communication. Let's do with an ending. Financial. Okay. There's going to be some form of, um, it's like hardship, but that brings good news in the long run. So, yeah, seeing things truthfully. Um, it's like, feel like you let your guard down about something but you can manifest whatever you want into your life and bring it forward yeah you just need to see yourself clearly and put in the work and the effort um, going forward okay financial abundance may I have the card for Gemini don't want a bunch. Just want one, please. Thank you. Okay. I trust my inner wisdom. As I go about my daily affairs, I listen to my own guidance. My intuition is always on my side. I trust it to be there at all times. I am safe. Financial. Abundance. Security. Thank you. Yep. Ah, okay. Here you go now. <laughs> yeah. My super attractor power comes from how I feel. My faith and love and the joy I put out. So, you attract what you put out. Remember that. You want to attract good, put out good. Financial abundance. Thank you. Compassion for all. Compassion is the beating heart of all spiritual practices. The peace you seek comes from the peace you create. 
Extend your compassion to all beings today. Including yourself. Everyone benefits when you are kind. May all beings be happy and free. Oh, look how beautiful. Bright and sunny. Eternity is a really, really, really long time. I think we'll be able to squeeze everything in. Relax. Peace and blue jeans, the universe. So, things pulling together for you. When you least expect it, it feels like. Okay, now, spiritually speaking. Okay, for you spiritually. Uh, for Gemini. What is the card that Gemini most needs to see? Spiritual. Spiritual. May I see the card for Gemini? Thank you. Okay, we've got Inner Temple. Devotion. Turn into the portal of your heart. I feel like that if you're doing too much of something that's not good for you, you really need to change that. You need to devote more um, to seeing yourself as the temple that you are, you know, and really take better care of yourself for some of you. For Gemini. Thank you, Spirit. We got three of emotion. Wonderful news is on its way. Announcements regarding engagements, pregnancies, births, and or graduations will be revealed. News new friends will be made, or communities of like minded people will draw closer to one another. Exciting new beginnings or happy endings are just around the corner. That's beautiful. Let me get the other one. That fell. Okay, we got Healer of Thought. It's time to clean up your life. Get rid of anything that clutters your space and makes you disorganized. People who take from you but don't give back should be released as well. You or another person involved in this situation is wise, insightful, and caring. Has a wonderful sense of humor and offers a lot of life experience. And then we have our spirit animal card for Gemini. Thank you, spirit. And you got two of them. Okay, you got number 48, porcupine spirit, number 66, white raven spirit. May want to look up that 6-6. Six, six. Porcupine Spirit, time for beginner mind. White Raven Spirit, trust in the magic. So I feel like you need to trust more in the magic within yourself too. Um, and what you can bring forth in your own life. All on your own. Okay. You've got Merlina. You are confused and indecisive because you do not have enough information. Do research or seek expert advice before making a decision. card for Gemini spiritual spiritual card spiritual card the message for no it's too many too many okay the message thank you we got two okay we've got sacral chakra number 10 um tens are about closure tens are about endings but endings bring forth new beginnings remember that and seven sacred space so 
uh, number 10 sacral chakra I feel comfortable in my own body and I'm sensitive to other people's feelings then we have number seven sacred space I find peace, security, and contentment when surrounded by nature's beauty. Okay. Spiritual for Gemini. Gemini, spiritual power. Six of Michael. It's the light at the end of the tunnel. Breathe a sigh of relief and make new plans, relocation, or travel. So things looking up for you. Things going in a better way. So that's what I've got for you. Thank you so much for being here with me. I appreciate each and every one of you more than you'll ever, ever know. And for those of you who have, um, you know, supported the channel as far as in other ways, um, um, donating and such, I appreciate each and every one of you. And I appreciate all of you, the ones who uh, watch and, and share the readings and speak on the readings and um, like and and follow and subscribe and heart and yeah and those of you who um, you know send donations um, or have visited my Amazon wish list I appreciate each and every one of you and till next time much light and love bye